Hello. Who have we got here? Richard. Madeline. OK, cool. Guys, come on, come on, that's so lively, come on, we're up against it, yeah? Come on, mate, come, come on, Jesus Christ. <laughs> All right, come on, Madeline. Thank you. Claimant Richard is bringing wife Madeline to court because she won't let him change the name she picked for his business website. Defendant Madeline says the business is doing fine as it is. So, we have our claimant Richard. And we have our defendant, Madeline. Yep. Thank you so much for coming to the court today. Uh, Richard, could you explain to me why it is you've brought Madeline to court? Well, I'm a photographer judge. I've got some skills. And a few years ago, I thought I'd showcase them on a website. Mm -hmm. And my wife chose the website name for me. OK. I don't think it's doing me any favours. OK. Um, what is the website name? It's Dick's Picks. <laughs> What's the problem with dick pics? Because your name is Richard. Yeah. It... And what's short for Richard is Dick. And you take pictures. Yeah. <laughs> so, what's the problem, mate? I wanted rich pics, which rolls off the tongue. <laughs> to be fair, dick pics does roll off the tongue, mate. <laughs> <laughs> However, I was shouted across the room, you're having dick's pics, and that look that goes with it. You know that look? Yeah. So, uh, how good is business at the moment? I think it could be better. But yeah. there's probably more work out there that I could deal with yeah. that probably isn't coming my way. People, uh, you can't Google me. You I'm can. Like... <laughs> <laughs> I can imagine that's a real anti-climax. Yeah. <laughs> I'm three million nine hundred thousand down on the search engine. So this is your wife, Madeline, and she will not let you change the website. That's it. Stuck with it. So, Madeline, um, why is it that you won't let Dick change his website? Because that's what he's known as. Everyone knows him as Dick. Right. So that's the name of the website. Okay, and, and um, but he's saying that he could make more business by changing the website. So what's well, the he's pitch? always complaining he's too busy as it is, so he don't need any more work. He's got enough work as it is. Well, I believe we've got some of the work. Yes, we do. This is number one. What is the story here? She's looking at the camera and he's checking out another that girl that's out of the <laughs> Did they ask to have this style of photo done? It's, it's mutual consent between three of us. <laughs> yeah, I'm not suggesting you force them to do it. But what <laughs> are they asking for I, different... I kind of semi-direct it. Right. You semi-direct it? Yeah. Come on, mate, you've got to drop the innuendos, otherwise I can't take this seriously. The next one. Yeah, that is beautiful. And that is what the best man has had a restraining order put against him. <laughs> Some things you have to fake. You have to fake? Yeah, so it wasn't a windy day. Yeah, uh, but if you wanted to look like a windy day, cut him out, mate. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you're defeating the object there. I wonder what's blowing her... Oh, I think it's that bloke <laughs> holding on to it there. But the lighting's beautiful. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> very nice. And Can there's a final one. OK. <laughs> and what do you call that? Motorboat wedding day. What's happening there? <laughs> Is he motorboating now? No, I think you're just having a little cuddle. They're not having a cuddle, cuddle. mate. <laughs> He's got his head in her bosom and he's going... Blah, 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 blah. That's, the, that's what that is. I'm looking for a lens. As yeah. far as I'm concerned, I'm just looking at composition and lighting. Good to go. Take a picture. Okay. I think you are a beautiful photographer Thank and you. one hell of an artist. Thank you. And I'd love you to paint me. <laughs> <laughs> are the clients happy with the photos you've done for them? I'm sure they love them. What do you mean you're sure? Have you not communicated? You... <laughs> Did you do the photos and then change your phone number or something? <laughs> Have you not spoken to them after? I've had no complaints yet. You've had no complaints yet. And you are busy. Your wife says that you're very busy. And, you're compl and you complain about being too busy. Uh, I'm too busy doing a lot of things for my wife. Like what? I've got to build a shed. I've got to build a pirate ship. You've got to build a pirate <laughs> ship? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it sounds like the coolest house ever. <laughs> what are you talking about? Well, my granddaughter, Ria, right. she wants a pirate ship. OK. Uh, six months old. It's going to take me... Uh, a hold bit on, hold on, hold on. How does a, a <laughs> six-month-old express that they want a pirate ship? <laughs> Through their mother and their nan. So they've got a telepathic connection with us? <laughs> <laughs> I've been told, build a pirate ship, there's the garden, get on with it. So right. you're busy building a pirate ship? Yeah. I'm, I'm trying. OK. No, it, it's not you... going to float, it's just going to be... Well, no, I'm not, I'm not... I don't think... <laughs> we don't think you're None Noah. of us thought that the six-month-old wanted to actually become a pirate. <laughs> so what do you want to change your website to? 
I'd like to see if I can get something that flows a bit better than uh, Dick's Picks. Dick Picks flows, mate. It really does. It and flows actually, beautifully. There's and some really successful businesses out there with, like, kind of freaky names. For example, we've got Herpes Pizza. <laughs> Herpes Pizza? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. If you like your pepperoni a little bit spicy, get some herpes. Um, the Glory Hole Church <laughs> Centre. <laughs> That's a very happy church. <laughs> that is one hell of a confessional yeah, box, that, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, okay, We've got on. the STD contractors. They're builders that just don't go away. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the next one is Fat <laughs> Noodle Bar. <laughs> Sorry. But it's a PH, so it's, you know. You can't spell noodle with PH. <laughs> Madeline, what is your issue with him changing the website? It works. It's a bit like your real name's Jonathan. Hey, 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 listen. <laughs> I'm not on trial here, Madeline. <laughs> I will throw you out of here. Do you understand? <laughs> Carry on. So, cos that works, the same as Romesh works for you, Dick works for him. OK, but Romesh doesn't mean penis. <laughs> <laughs> I've only got your word for that. <laughs> I rule in favour of the claimant. Get them up. <laughs> Ten years on that, he never told me his name was Jonathan. Uh... How dare you? <laughs> Disrespect a judge like that. Get out of here and take Dick with you. I think justice will serve. Uh, judge Romess, with his little knowledge of the law, was able to see through and give me a viable outcome that I can move forward with my business in the future. Can I jump in here? You know what I think's going on? Is you know how amazing he is and you are scared of sharing your dick with the world. Do you have anything to say? Yeah, as Dick said, Romish does know only a little bit of the law, hence why I feel that injustice was done today and that he should keep the website as Dick's picks. Oh, God. Nothing as vicious as a woman scorned. But you know what? I've got a feeling you two are going to be OK. <laughs> Off you go. <laughs> Come on. Oh, no, no, through the fake door. Oh. We have a door, I mean, I know that. <laughs> yeah, just to make the props people feel important. <laughs>